find out. He's standing by downstairs. He's the winning pitcher tonight, Sean. Thanks for stopping by. Early home run by Chris Davis. All of a sudden, you're up three nothing. How much does how much does that settle you in and let you relax a little bit? Oh, you know, it helps me out a lot. Um, you know, when the uh, when the offense comes through, then I can just uh, you know go in cruise mode and and uh, you know attack with my fastball. And that's what uh, you know the offense did a really good job today. And um, I was just happy with how things turned out. And you're talking about your fastball, Bruce Maxwell, your catcher, seemed to be calling off-speed pitches. And when you threw the fastball, you had a tendency to throw it more inside of the right-handers. But talk about your off-speed pitches and really going with your catcher, Maxwell, especially getting the strikeouts that you did. Yeah, Bruce called an amazing game today. And, uh, you know, I, I was really happy how he, uh, you know, blocked the balls when I got 0-2 or 1-2. And uh, everything I was doing was uh, just trying to locate with my fastball. And when uh, I got 0-2, 1-2, uh, just try to finish him off with the heater. And, uh, you know, like I said, he was calling a great game. And, uh, you know, I completely trusted him. And, uh, Happy how things turned out. He got a hug from Walk. How much fans are getting better than that, right? No, he's he's an awesome dude. It was, it was awesome getting out, getting a hug. Sean, tonight your 19th start in the big leagues. And, and looking back at, let's say your first five or six starts, and now your last 10. Mm -hmm. uh, how much difference has it been for you? What what are the things that you felt that you've improved on the most uh, from earlier in the year? Uh, I would, just, you know, just having that confidence going out uh, every game and. Uh, you know, just believing in myself and knowing that I'm going to, you know, dominate that day. And, you know, those first couple games where uh, it was, I had a couple all right ones and there were some pretty bad ones. But, uh, you know, as as the time's gone on, uh, you know, I've, I've uh, kind of realized that I'm, you know, I'm, I'm all right. And, uh, you know, I, I can I can get these guys out and uh, it's just just helped me out with a lot with my confidence. And uh, I was just really really happy that they uh, you know they believe in me and um, I'm just able to go out and do my job and uh, just try to grow as a pitcher. You know you seem to be very all right at the Coliseum. What is it special about pitching in Oakland. I know there are some games on the road that you have not particularly enjoyed because <laughs> of the numbers but but what's special about here at the Coliseum. Uh, the fans are amazing you know like uh, I heard Beaumont say uh, you know even though there's might be like 15,000 people here. It sounds like there's 30,000 and uh, you know the right foot crazes with the drums and <laughs> it just the the whole atmosphere is awesome and uh, you know it just really relaxes me and knowing that you know everybody has my back and uh, it's just a lot of fun here. So when I'm having fun, it, it just everything just like on a cruise control and I can uh, you know just go out and, and uh, you know do my job. Well, Sean, congratulations on the win. Thanks for stopping by. Thank you. Right, so Sean Manai gets his fifth win and. Uh...